We'll guide you through how to fix Bluetooth devices not working in Windows 11. If you find this useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. This is super useful to go and do. And you can follow this whether you're using a Bluetooth speaker, headphones, a keyboard, it doesn't matter, I'm keeping this guide broad. So first of all, go to the bottom of your computer and click on the Windows Start button and open up your settings like so. Then come over to the left and select Bluetooth and devices. As you can see, I'm currently connected to my Bluetooth speaker here, and let's go and say it wasn't working. First of all, simply just go and restart Bluetooth. You can go and switch it off, and once it goes and turns off, just go and wait a couple of seconds and you can go and turn it back on like so. It should then automatically go and reconnect again. Go and see if that solves the problem. Sometimes it's as simple as that. If it still doesn't, then what I recommend is you fully restart the connection. So click on the three dots in the top right and click on remove device like that. And then you want to click on add device, click on Bluetooth. Then what you'll need to do is go and put the device back into pairing mode. If it doesn't go and show up, when you go and see it, go and click on it and it should then go and connect again. And after it goes and connects, go and see if that goes and solves the problem. As you can see, there it is. See if that solves the problem. If it doesn't, then scroll down on the left and click on windows update. And then what you need to do is go down until you can go and see advanced options and you want to go and click on optional updates here. If there are any, sometimes these are to do with Bluetooth drivers and things like that. So if there are, download them and install them and see if that goes and solves the problem. If that still doesn't or there's none to do here, then what I recommend you do is you make sure there are no controls on the Bluetooth device itself. If they're headphones or maybe a keyboard, sometimes they're gonna have their own switch on, specifically headphones. They may have like a mute setting, so you think they're not working, but it's just because they're muted. So there are a few different things like that you can check out. Hopefully one of the methods in this video has solved your problem. If it did, please consider subscribing and liking the video.